It's no secret local businesses have had a tough time keeping up during the pandemic from switching entire business models to supply chain issues and staffing shortages. 2021, quite the whirlwind. Oh yeah, you can say that again. Mm -hmm. Now the Grand Rapids Chamber holding their annual State of Grand Rapids business meeting to reflect on 2021 and forecast how things may look in 2022. That meeting is tomorrow morning. Arusa Ruta Alsanaida has a preview and a look into how businesses have persevered. Good morning, Ruta. Good morning, you guys. Well, 2022 is actually starting off pretty strong for local businesses, or at least better than things may have been last year. But there's still a long way to go for your favorite mom and pop shops and local restaurants. Things are heating up for local businesses in 2022. Cheers. Business is starting off strong in the new year for places like K-Rock in downtown Grand Rapids. After multiple delays due to staffing shortages, they finally opened their doors October 30th of last year. But even then, as owner Robert Yoon explains, times were tough. We had definitely a staffing problem opening night, but it's, it's getting a little better. A little better is on theme for Grand Rapids Chamber's annual state of business meeting Wednesday, where they'll go over the difficulties of 2021 and what businesses can expect in the new year. Well, for 2021, I think uh, there was a, a lot of a learning curve that, that was still going on from 2020. But what I can tell you about 2022, and this is what I say to everybody, is I'm very optimistic about what is uh, what is coming down the pipe. The meeting will serve as a gathering place for business owners to discuss what's worked and what hasn't. And economists will present an outlook for 2022. Economists like Paul Isley with Grand Valley State University's College of Business. You can really think of that as a pendulum. So we really pulled the pendulum really far up um, and we're growing really, really fast and really, really hot. And what's going to happen over the course of the next year is that prices and interest rates and changes in government spending will start to swing that pendulum in the other direction and really start to slow the economy down. He says he hopes the pendulum doesn't swing too far back so businesses can survive the uncertainties of a pandemic. But changing gears and adapting is nothing new to resilient business owners like Yoon. We just we just need the support and we want to make you guys happy. Who still has high hopes for a great year at his restaurant and karaoke bar. It's, it's got to get better. 2022 is I'm hoping to be one of the best years for small businesses if it can be. Yeah. Now again, the state of Grand Rapids business meeting taking place tomorrow morning at DeVos Place. It is hosted by the Grand Rapids Chamber of Commerce. So members get in at a reduced price, but the event open to everybody. You can find all that information, where to buy your tickets, all on our website, fox17online.com. For now, reporting live in the newsroom, Rudolph Sinaida, Fox 17 News.